It's okay, Koa. She bring it straight to emerge? No, she needs to go for some x-rays first to figure out why her back is causing her so much pain. My little girl! <laughs> I guess I'll have to wait out here. Hello, Cora. Hi. Is your back giving you problems, dear? Yes. So explain to me, when did this pain stop? I've been having it for a few days, and I've been taking Advil and stuff. Okay, um, so how old are you? I've been 15 years old. Okay, what grade are you going into in the fall? <laughs> 10th grade. Okay, Cora, um, so I really don't know what could be wrong here. Your spine does look a bit curvy, so we're just going to be taking some x-rays. Alright. Okay, Cora, please be very still and stay very calm while the, while the x-ray does its scan. Okay. Ah, I see. Is my back broken? Well, it didn't help because you said you fell down the stairs. No, Cora. Um, in fact, your back isn't broken. But... But what? You have scoliosis. Cora? What? I said you had scoliosis. Had or have? Have scoliosis. Have. My god, am I okay? Yes, you're at a 84 degrees. And so, you need surgery. What? Yes. No, 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 not before my... My, um, 10th grade year, not before my sophomore year. Sorry, surgery is recommended within the next few months. Can we just do it now? Yes. Um, so, well, not now, but we're going to keep you in the hospital for a few days. And then you can have your scoliosis surgery. Um, over the weekend, because we want to do it on this weekend. Okay, so... And then you'll be in the hospital for about a week. And then we'll be able to let you go home. Okay. Honey, hi. Hi. I really hope Cora's okay. Take that to the doctor now. Hello, Millers. Hi, where's our daughter? Oh, she's still laying on the examination table. But I have to let you know something. Is she okay? Please tell me our daughter's okay. Yes. And there goes Mrs. Miller. Your daughter's okay, but I found out something with her spine. Uh-oh. It's curved as she's grown. My God. So this means she has scoliosis. What's Kali? Kali? Yes, our firstborn. Um, she... Oh no, actually our thirdborn. She, um, actually got scoliosis when she was 14. Now she's 23. Yes, well, Cora has scoliosis and it's at a degree where we need surgery, so we're going to be giving her surgery over the weekend. So what weekend? Saturday we'll do it. August 21st. Is when we'll be doing her surgery. <laughs> and then she'll be spending a week in the hospital. So that will be until August the 28th. And then she'll be able to go home. Unless she's able to go home earlier. Oh my god. So much is going on, Sean. Christina. <laughs> have the baby. Christina's moving out this weekend. Cause I'm in surgery this weekend. We will figure it out, okay? Before I left, Christina was already going back and forth. She is? Yeah, she told me that over the next few days, between, because today's Tuesday, remember? Um, 
we are going to be going back and forth. Okay. We know today's, yeah, Tuesday. On Thursday, August 19th. Alrighty, guys, a family update. Um, um, Christina's apartment went on the market today, so she's been going back and forth. She officially is moving out tomorrow, so tonight they're sleeping at the apartment. She's moving out. I mean, most of the, her furniture's gone, but, yeah, she moved her furniture, some of the furniture back from our house to her apartment. Cora's in the hospital. She's upstairs, and she's been doing tests. So she'll, they're not sending her home yet. She won't come home till next week. Um, so yes. Oh yeah, our other kids moved back home. Yeah, Kali, Kobe, Carter, and Cooper moved home. Actually, no, Kobe didn't. Kobe actually went to move to Sandy's apartment. With her mom and dad. With her mom. Yeah, Kobe went to go live with Sandy. Um, so yes. And, Co yeah. But Kali came back home, although she's considering about moving out to her own apartment. Um, but Carter came home. So yeah, and Kali. Kali and Kali, Carter and Cooper were the only ones that came back. So yes, now that means we have three children moved out. So now there's only fifteen kids at home. <sighs> Everyone's moving out. All fourteen because <sighs> Because Cora. Yes, because of Cora. So, this is now the teen's bedroom. Very nice. And Cora's bedroom when she gets home. She just hasn't been home to see it yet. And Heather and I moved upstairs, and then our kids are just across the hall from us. Yeah. Hey guys, Christina here. So, we just we just finished renovating Kobe's outside. But me and my siblings decided to renovate this apartment a bit for the new owners. So, yes. Um, so, here it is. Very nice. So our apartment um goes um for sale tomorrow, so we're really excited that we're moving out tomorrow. And all of the bags we moved a lot of the stuff over to the new house, like a lot of our bags and stuff is already gone. So yes. Hey guys, it's me Kobe. So Sandy and I are moving to our apartment. Well yeah, we're moving in with my mother. So yes. Because my parents have divorced. Well oh, Sandy. You know, Kobe, it would be really be nice to start a family one day. Uh, oh, sorry, elevator guy. Hey, guys, so a little update on Claire and I. We are moving to our college because we start, you know, uni I mean university. Yeah, we're moving to university. Um, so, yes, we won't be home. Yeah. Kali, so what are, you plan what are your plans for life? Well, no, I haven't really found, yeah, like, what I'm going to do yet, because I ha don't have, I'm not married yet, and even Kobe now moved out. Yeah, well, we're moving out soon, too. Oh, so much moving, I know. And also, guys, I'm here, and Carter is also back home, it's just, oh, sorry, I don't know where he is, but yeah, he's back here also. So much moving right now, it's all your kids, you're constantly back and forth, and moving here, and moving there. Yes, we know, Grandma. Oh my god. Mom, Dad, I don't want to have surgery. I know you don't, dear. I got that surgery in two days. How, like... I don't want to get child to the hospital for two days. It's okay. Kali went through the exact same surgery. Yes, I did, Cora. I was terrified just like you, but it's all worth it in the end. It is. Your spine is good. You just got two wads in your back. Because before my back used to be like this. Now it's like this. Don't worry, sis. I'll be here for you. Thanks, Kali. You're welcome. You, nothing to be afraid of, Cora. You're a brave girl. Yes, Cora. We know you will do great for the surgery. 
Thanks, Mom and Dad. I'm really nervous. I know you are, sweetie. Bye. Thanks for watching.